Mornay Stain is definitely up there among the best Springbok fly-offs of all time. He made his Springbok debut all the way back in 2009, yet many think that he could still feature for the box again at the ripe age of 36, purely because of how well he has been playing recently. I will never forget the day when every South African fell in love with Mornay Stain. It was the day he made the winning kick in the second test of the British and Irish Lions Tour in 2009. With that kick, he stole the series and our hearts. Fast forward 12 years and he can kick just as well and he's even more handsome. Now some might have thought that the Bulls were out of their minds when they brought Mornay back to Loftus in 2020. It almost felt like Victor Matfield all over again. I guess I could come out of retirement. When Mornay made his return to the Bulls, many expected him to be merely a mentor figure in the background. However, he soon exceeded expectations by becoming a key part of the Bulls success in the Curry Cup and Super Rugby Unlocked. Let's dig into his most recent stats. His goal kicking accuracy was 88% in the Curry Cup, second only to Franz Stein. He doesn't gain many meters with the ball in hand, but he makes up for it with his try assists. In 2020, there was a stage he had made five try assists within six games. His tackling record is even more impressive considering his age and how physical domestic rugby is at the moment. His stats really do speak volumes. We salute you, Mornay Stein. It's going to be interesting to see what else he is capable of in the remaining years of his career. With Andre Pollard still suffering a Severe injury, it may just be possible that Mornay Stain will be caught up to the box squad for the British and Irish Lions tour. If he's playing good rugby, why wouldn't you want an experienced mind like that in the mix? Who knows? Maybe Mornay Stain will slot a series winning penalty and make South Africa fall in love with him all over again. But maybe I'm just dreaming.